Hello, I'm Richard Ridge for Broadway World. Dance Moms Nia Sue is joining the cast of Trip of Love for the summer beginning on July 12th. And we're here at Stage 42 to meet Nia and bring you a sneak peek. <music> downs with dance moms and everything but I mean the hard work pays off and I'm so happy that I'm getting to use my skills that I used for dance moms and apply them to this show. Is it a dream come true for you to come to New York and do a big splashy show like Trip of Love? Oh my gosh this is a dream come true I mean I've been dreaming of this since I was like two this has always been my vision, just performing on stage on Broadway in New York with a cast, just this is what I do. I'm a performer. I like to entertain people. And just 60s music. I mean, had you learned some of these dances? Had you done sort of some of the styles on Dance Moms? Actually, we have. We've done the pony, <laughs> we've done the jerk, but I mean, Everything's so new. I love getting this whole vocabulary of new dancing, new dances, and getting to learn new choreography because, I mean, we do it on the show, but we don't do a lot of it. So this is such a change, and it's really exciting. Look, I'm excited that Nia's here today. I mean, I've been watching her since her first routine when she was on Dance Mom. So to see her all grown up and, and really picking up this material as quickly as she did and going out there and just selling the hell out of it was pretty impressive to me yeah oh absolutely I mean she's been a dream to work with at this point I she's had much less time than the rest of us did to learn the show and she stepped right into it today and it was like she'd been with us the whole time so what's it been like that she just arrived on Monday you know she finished season six of Dance Moms yes. and she arrived on Monday what's this week been like so far it has been a whirlwind I mean we've had three days of rehearsal eight hours a day and basically she's learned three-fourths of the show in three days which is a tremendous amount of information, along with shoe fittings, wig fittings, costume fittings, and the whole gamut. And today was the first time sort of really being incorporated with the company, and then we continue today, more rehearsals, tomorrow and Saturday. It must be great for you. I mean, she did six seasons on Dance Moms. She's learned so much, because she told me they learn numbers in like two hours. Right. So, you know, she, for her learning this, it's a lot, but I'm sure it came a little easier for her. Well, it did. I mean, and I sort of, suspected that from what they have to go through on the TV show knowing that she's a very quick retainer and learner and so forth and throwing the choreography she's learning two production numbers a day so it's been amazing well this has to be so exciting for you to have your daughter here in New York ready to make her stage debut in New York I mean how does that feel the proudest mama ever to be honest with you it's one of those things that you hope and dream that you can help support your child achieving her dreams and to think that she's 15 and having this opportunity is amazing so surreal so six seasons on dance moms i mean that's really helped her a lot to prepare for this because she was telling me she learned dances like two hours oh absolutely it's unbelievable and people wonder well why would you ever put your kid in that type of experience reality tv and I will say for all the negatives that the show sometimes has controversy, it has prepared her so well for this incredible opportunity. And we're humbled by the opportunity for Nia to be on stage with an incredible cast of people. Uh, I think to learn choreography, and she's learned a, a, an incredible amount <laughs> in the last three days. Prepare, you know, what she's learned on this show has prepared her for this day, and that's why we did what we did. It's a, big, a great platform. She was noticed, and from that opportunity has led her to this incredible opportunity. So everything kind of happens for a reason, and I think all of those uh, high-pressure situations where you have to learn a dance in two to three hours, she's learning them, and she's putting that into good practice. Mm -hmm.